Ugh. Getting to be, we already looked at this one. God damn it. I don't remember where we stopped last because it's been too long. That one we did. What about this one? This one's cheap. I love this right here. Guys, this is what we're talking about. Ladies and gentlemen, it's a $3 million, three bed, five bathroom home here in sunny, beautiful Los Angeles, California. This is Bo's house. We're inside with film. You might recognize the outside from the end of inside. This is where he leaves and then goes back in. It's a beautiful home though. Very artistic, very stylish. Makes you even more impressed at the fact that Bo Burnham spent all that time in that one little room when his home was very nice looking. All of this gorgeous. Wait, I know where this is. Wait, what the fuck? Wait, I, wait, 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 whoa! I lived next door to Bo Burnham, what the fuck? I lived, I lived, I lived right here. This, I literally, this was my apartment building right here. I used to run down this street. <laughs> what the fuck? Yeah, dude, this street had a big ass like uh, lavender tree. Okay, I mean, I don't remember looking at it from the outside, right? But yeah, this was my route for running. That's so weird. Oh, also like, you know I live there because I look at it, I look at that belt, I'm like, wait a minute, that's the escape room and Enigma iced coffee spot. And there it is, the room where it all happened. My old AMG car is on Street View. Look at the old address. Is it really? <laughs> no, it's not. It's literally, literally the rent sign is right here. They updated it. I can't believe I never got a call. This window right here was the window that my soundproof booth was up against pretty much, this back wall. And I had an AC unit in here. And the AC unit dripped the whole time that I lived there for five years. And the, uh, and it made the wall bow out and nobody ever told me that I needed to pay for it. So that's cool. What is this thing, huh? If your home has terraced stairs, you rich. If your home has a boat in the middle of your walkway, you rich. I won't load, so fuck out of here. All right, this one's a more affordable $1,900,000, four bed, six bath, 10,000 square foot house here in Hidden Lake Drive, Howell, Missouri. It is on a lake and you can see it's got a nice gravel entryway. Why? Don't fucking know. We've styled the outside to look a little bit like um, every single rec center for old people. And it's painted green and peach. Because fuck you. What's this area for? Not sure. But you could, you could, you could do that. Michigan, Missouri. It's all the same to me. Wood paneling. Wood paneling. Brown. Have we looked at this home? No, it's very brown. Sauna shitter. This is $2 million? It's gotta be on a ton of land, right? Damn, there's so much wood. Booba. Why does this look so weird? This house is weird. Why is this $2 million? Cause you have the whole lake to yourself. I'm sorry, dude, but people talk, all your friends be like, yo, I got lakefront property and this is the lake. And you're like, all right, sick, dude. It's not that I don't think lakes are cool. It's just that like some lakes don't look inviting and this is one of them. You know what I mean? It looks like a water retention pond and you're like, all right, sick. Mm. This is in Encino, California and it is $9 million. I have no clue why. I mean, probably because it's three homes in one, I guess. And it's probably like, well, yeah, it's, it's, this is somebody's nice archi- Oh yeah, this is an 80s porn house if I've ever seen it. There's so much loose cocaine being done on every reflective surface in this home. I forgot we've seen this. Yeah, you're right. I forgot because I was like, damn, this is actually super nice. This one's $1 million. It's a render. Is it not? It's built like this? Who built their home like this? There's more columns than anything. I can see eight columns. Nine. See, there's ten co- one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. There's ten columns. That's so inconvenient. Holy shit. Bro, you're gonna take a second mortgage out on your home? That's what it feels like you're about to do. Miss Teacher, I have a question. What the fuck is going on with the walls here? What is this? 
What's 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 ha what's Wait, what? What? Wait, what? Wait, what the fuck is that? Wait, what? This is part of the same home? You have like a weird walkway courtyard and then... Is this a grill? It's an outdoor shower? Why? Why? What do you need to shower from? What are these railings here for? Who designed this entire place? What the fuck? fuck is this place this place is insane no look at the pool design dude somebody just took a crayon uh to to like the top of a macaroni grill tablecloth and drew this out it's in phoenix arizona this is cute i mean it's a cute home nice garden narrow lot backyard in a quaint town somewhere in boston yep you know this is a cute bostonian little town shed but What's the draw here? More folk, that's it? 1.5 million though. I mean, it's off market, so they probably removed a bunch of the photos, but. I mean, for half the price, you could get this. I mean, for, for a, a third of the price, you can get this. Wood panel, spiral staircase, absolutely awful looking metal wood, wood or metal wood, Jesus, metal spiral uh, stairs. I don't hate the fact that you have a center skylight like that. I actually think the bar is kind of classy. Like this is like, if I walked into somebody's place, like an Airbnb, this is kind of cool, right? Like if you were spending a weekend here, this would be kind of chill. It's a, it's got a good vibe to it. I don't, I don't, I don't like the, I don't like how worn out the colors of the couch are, but, and, and the, even the, the carpet, the rug, but water slide. Ew. Look at these, huh? Look at this, huh? Look at these, look at these chairs okay well uh, all right i mean it's it's you it, i guess it works all, all right i uh, sure a lot of round rooms you know how i feel about round rooms but ultimately not the worst thing in the world this couch too like almost like a corduroy i kind of get behind it this rug was custom made for this look it fits around the couch and everything definitely a lot of light this is a big indoor pool. Also, I like how they have like a second story and they're just like, what's that for? I, I don't know. This looks like they added this in as like a secondary thought because it doesn't look very well maintained. I don't have the top to this and I'm trying to shake it up and using my hand as a top is not a good idea. Wow, this is a thing. That's, this is a, this is, this is the 80s. Gamer chairs. Imagine being a hardcore gamer and you sleep in a bed like this. Unbelievable. Why is there a ladder? Why is there a bridge? What are you supposed to do up here? This is so dangerous. I don't, you, the floor is warped up here. This is dangerous, guys. <laughs> Look at all the deck space that they have that they're definitely not using for anything. And you probably need to have somebody come out and refinish all of the decks because there's so much deck space. Very interesting home.